Hello techies In the upcoming tutorials we will learn about test analytics action which are available under Microsoft Cognitive Actions in Power Automate Desktop First we learn what is text analytics Text analytics is a text mining AI service that uncovers insights such as sentiment analysis entities relations and key phrases in unstructured text if you see on my screen i am having actions panel under that we are having cognitive actions inside that i am having microsoft cognitive actions there you can see i am having bing spell check computer vision test analytics action inside the text analytics action we are having detect long ways action key phrase action sentiment analysis action in the upcoming sessions we are going to work with these actions by using text analytics api all right now we'll see what is text analytics api the text analytics api is a cloud based service that provides advanced natural language processing over raw text and includes four main functions such as sentiment analysis key phrase extraction named entity recognition and long ways detection the text analytics api is the part of azure cognitive services a collection of machine learning and ai algorithms in the cloud for the development projects now i will show you how to create test analytics api by using azure cognitive services let's switch to browser and there i'm going to give the url as portal.azure.com after providing username and password and once it has been successfully logged into that we'll see this kind of services in the microsoft azure there you can see i'm having dashboard in such a way cognitive services resource group quick start center virtual machines and lot of services are available now this text analytics api is belongs to cognitive services there i can go through the cognitive services or i can directly go for the search resources there i am going to give text analytics and there you can find the services in a such a way text analytics let's click on that to create text analytics api there you will find the cognitive services inside that i'm going to create text analytics api now if you see as of now i have not created any text analytics api so that there you will find zero records as of now to create text analytics api you can click on create and there if you see i i need to provide additional features over here if you want to create a new resource group in that case you are going to create a new resource group in our previous sessions we have already created our resource group so that i am going to skip this step and then you can see the text analytics basic details where you can unlock the insights from unstructured text using advanced natural language processing using sentiment analysis to find out what customers think about your brand it's a kind of sentiment and after that key phrase extraction and identify the long ways of the text by using long ways detection these are all the features that what we have by using text analytics all right now i want to create a text analytics api so that i'm going to provide the project details over here there you can see the subscription i'm going to give it as pay as you go and uh, i'm going to give the resource group over here as bing resource or the resource which you have created for the text analytics you can give that resource group over here and after that the instance detail the region is the first parameter where i'm going to select east us and the name of the text analytics i'm going to give it as power automate desktop hyphen text analytics api this is the name which i'm going to give it for this api for the text analytics and pricing tier i'm going to select free fo as of now i'm going to use free fo if you want to give any kind of standard one in that case you are going to use another pricing tier you can go ahead and you can select it as of now i'm going to use free fo that is 5k transaction per 30 days now over here 
the responsible AI notice, I need to select this checkbox over here. I certify that I have reviewed and acknowledged the terms in the responsible AI notice. Then I'm going to click on review plus create. Then I'm going to click on create. Now it is trying to validate my text analytics API. And you can see on the right hand side, it's trying to initialize and submitting the deployment process. Let's click on that. There you can see the deployment is in progress. It will take some time to deploy the API in the Azure Cognitive Services. Now the text analytics API has deployed successfully. There you can see your deployment is completed. Now if we say I'm having inputs, I can provide the inputs over here and I have outputs over here and you can see the templates tab over here. All right. Now, once again, if you see over here, I'm having schemas over here, the resource group over here, the parameters and all the details related to the text API related to the configuration has been shown over here in this API. All right. Now we'll see the keys, subscription keys for that. Let's click on overview over here. Go to resources. There, if you see, I'm having all the information related to the text analytics API. There you can see resource management, monitoring, automation, and whatnot. In the upcoming sessions, we are going to work with subscription keys and the region where we can find all these details. There you can see keys and endpoint. Click on that. There we can get the keys which are going to be using as part of the Power Automate desktop text analytics action. There we need to provide the subscription keys. Along with that, we need to provide the region. So we are already having these keys. The same keys we are going to copy. At the same time, we can copy the region also. All right. If you see, I'm having endpoint also where it is going to be connecting my Power Automate desktop actions to this API by using the subscription keys along with the region. All right. Now I will show you where exactly that we are going to use. Let me drag any one of the action which are related to the text analytics onto the workspace. There you can see the server location. I'm going to give it the region over here as East US because of we have configured our text analytics in the East US and we are going to provide the subscription key which we have generated for the text analytics API, right? These are all the required information for these test analytics action. All right. I hope you understand what is test analytics and how to create text analytics API by using Azure Cognitive Services. Thank you for watching Power Automate tutorials. If you have any queries related to this concept, please post them in the comment section. I will see you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye. Have a wonderful day.